In order for any university to be competitive today, you must have some form of online learning. Not just online learning, but a quality online program. Teaching online is a lot more rewarding if you think about it as its own thing. What can you do online that you couldn't do in a face-to-face -face class? And if you go towards your online teaching with that attitude, you can find a lot of really creative, challenging, interesting things that you can do in your classroom. Teaching ultimately, for me, I want it to be a meaningful experience for my students. And I've found empirically that it can be a meaningful experience teaching online, and CDL helps out with that uh, very much with regard to the online teaching. CDL has helped me in a few significant ways. I have a very good relationship with my instructional designer. If I have an idea, when I talk to my instructional designer, we can make the ideas happen. The instructional designers, they represent the side of the swimming pool. You know, we get out there and we start swimming and swimming and swimming, but every once in a while we need to go back and touch the side of the pool to let us know where we are. I have used my instructional designer for the last two years. I have never not been able to get an answer or get something solved. My first line of defense is my instructional designer, which CDL provided. We don't oftentimes have time to interact with people who are really as interested in online education as we are. So I think the best kept secret is that relationship you can develop. Online faculty need to understand that they know their content, but CDL knows the technology. The CDL media folks did a lot of custom work with me. I actually approached them with a project and they said okay. And what it was was I wanted to make two to three videos for every module where I'd send the scripts to them, they'd get them on the teleprompter, and we'd produce these videos. I think we produced all those videos in two days. So great assistance and helping making online learning user friendly. CDL helped me produce three videos. One in particular was for a graduate course where I introduced a unit for the students and I told them how to navigate the page. Also on the left side, under I had received positive feedback from the media that I use in my courses from my students. They feel that the class is more complete. They tell me in their evaluations that they think that I have worked hard for them. They can feel it, that they feel special. I use several pieces of the kind of repeatable content that comes from CDL that they've provided. So I do use the information literacy modules that run out of something called Obojobo, and I use that for plagiarism so that the students have a sense of what plagiarism is as well as citing sources. It's wonderful to not have to take students through the process of citing sources. And I've also used the games. This provides some good practice for the students, and again, it's something that I don't have to build. Another thing that CDL has helped me with is a game for one of my classes where students had to learn sentence patterns. That was a lot of fun. And then for my History of the English Language class, they made me a graphic that has a medieval manuscript open in it, and it looks really nice. My advice for new faculty working with CDL would be to lean as heavily as they can on the CDL resources. Share freely and share often with the instructional designer what they want, and CDL probably already has a program in place to help them out. I think the Center for Distributed Learning has been very supportive. I have, in many occasions, reached out to them. They are efficient, and they're accurate, and they are fast. Faculty sometimes don't want to ask for help. That's a mistake, because the technical support has been wonderful. You just have to ask. I think the leadership are also willing to go around to the colleges to see what the needs of the colleges are. That teamwork, that relationship, that partnership, it continues on throughout the year, and for my case, throughout the years. As CDL grows, we grow. Get to know the staff, get to know their resources, and I guarantee you there is something, if not many things, that they offer that you can use as a new faculty member to enhance your career.